Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a 2025 Grand Design Reflection 100 Series, model number 28RL, weighs 8,400 pounds. Great opposing slide, island kitchen, real living and floor plan. Awesome model. This is going to be smashing dinosaurs and Lego together. I'm here with my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer, on the camera today. Brendan? How's it going, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for tuning into the number one RV YouTube channel world. Please don't look that up. If you don't mind hitting that like and subscribe button, we'd greatly appreciate it. Grand Design has done a beautiful refresh for 2025 on the interior, and we're here for it. We love it. We're on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook. We're even on Pinterest. Check us out there as well. Enjoy the video. Right on, B. Good looking front light there at the front pin box, eh? Love it. Just turn that on for you. White fiberglass cap, 1621 pin box here at the front, and then our rougher style storage in behind it. You've got all kinds of storage to the left there. We've got the 60 amp charge controller, solar disconnect, unit disconnect, power converter, and then right here is where your battery and box will go. We're gonna have 30 pumper paint tanks on either side. And then a lot of the, uh, uh, like the beginner level fifth wheels are missing the auto leveling. We still got auto leveling here on this, uh, this model here. And then right here we have our pass through storage from one side to the other, the controls for auto leveling over to the left. We've also got our gate valves down at the bottom, city water connection, fresh water fill, winterizing, sanitizing, black water flush kit, outside shower, outside receptacle, and then our on-demand Furion water heater with our furnace vent here, 50 amp detachable style cord, 15 inch tires, Goodyear endurance tires, aluminum rims, Moride Cree 3000 suspension, rack and pinion style slide. Rack and pinion, baby. Class three receiver right there at the back, four-way wiring, roof ladder, get up on your roof, check your seals every 90 days. That's a one-piece roof, which is all like my grandmother's bathing suit. And then we also have backup camera prep over there. Uh, <clears throat> we have our outside TV location if you want to add one of those on. And then down below, a little bit of an outside gas port here. And then our sewer hose holder. And then here we have secure steps right to the ground, nice and solid, droopy grab handle, range hood vent there, screen defender on the actual door. And then just right here is the other side of our pass-through storage. And then as we slide in here, Brandon, let's see what kind of travel access we have. I know we can't get to the fridge because the island's in the way, but we can get up the hallway and get to our bedroom and bathroom all on the side of the road. Let's get this guy opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that 28RL reflection. You've taken one step up into the living space, looking back here into our island kitchen, and uh, you've taken a step up into the bedroom bathroom, looking back in the living space. Here's our freestanding table and chairs. I like this way they do this because you can pull this ottoman out, bring it in front of the couch, and just have a chair on either side. I also love that there's no table lag in the way. You'll notice, there's no carpet in the slide here as well. And then the new interior for 2025 has a nice light fabric on it. Very wipeable, but very easy to clean. Manual recliners facing our TV. Pull, flip over piece here for cup holders. And then a spot there to just uh, plug in your phone if you want to. Windows continue around the back side here. They're all sliding windows with a pullout style couch. Under, uh, we have uh, receptacles underneath that. And then cubby, cubbies on either side with couch side tables. And then cupboards here across the top too. Nice smoked glass, soft closed doors, which is great. And then right here, we have our TV directly across from our theater seats. New for 2025. They finally opened up this space in behind the TV to get yourself more storage. Our radio is in through here. And then cubbies on either side with our fireplace built in down below. There's also a nice uh, drawer and then skinny cupboards here on either side. Here's our 10 cubic foot 12 volt fridge. Our fire, our fireplace, our microwave is here. Range hood is there, a cu small cupboard there. Undermount uh, three burner stove top with a glass stove top cover. Oven itself, pot and pan drawer, and then a skinny cupboard right here. Now this 10 cubic foot 12 volt fridge is running off the battery. The battery is being charged off the 180 solar watt on the uh, solar, 180 <laughs> watt solar panel on the roof. And then as we get into the island here, we have an undermount stainless steel sink pull-out faucet. Uh, down below it, 
We got a cupboard right there. Huge. Uh, big cupboard for garbage can or whatever you want to use. Three drawers here down the right hand side. And new colors. New colors. A uh, little more of a... It's like a gray white. E e yeah. A white. <laughs> right? That's oh, accurate. Yeah. Over here's our hutch with receptacles on both sides. Got a nice drawer here. A fake cupboard here hiding our breakers and fuses. And then three drawers down the center with another drawer over here and another cupboard down below. Looking up, we got a shelf here. Cupboards on either side. Cupboards there. And then sliding up into the uh, bedroom bathroom. Slightly lighter steps than before. Slightly lighter steps. And then have that new coloring here in the bathroom as well. Porcelain style toilet, <clears throat> cupboard, drawer, big sink, shelf, and medicine cabinet. And then behind me, we've got a spot here to hang up the towels. We've also got a shelf there. And then into the shower. Yeah, lots of space for your boy Josh here. I'm six feet tall, all kinds of height. We got a light in the shower too, which is always a great thing. And then coming into the bedroom, it's a 60 by 80 inch queen. Open storage across the shelf, uh, across the top with a shelf down below, cupboards on either side, cupboards on either side, bedside tables, USBs and receptacles on both sides too with nice lights. And then around the corner, <clears throat> we got our wardrobe here, motion sense of light, spot to kick off the slippers, and then two drawers down below. That's the video folks. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.